Hey everyone, it's Kendall, and as you can see by the title, I'm doing a portrait of Kylie Jenner out of Kylie Lip Kit. So I started with just this inking that I did before I started anything in Micron pencils. And I put that on top of a light board with a nice piece of Bristol paper. And I'm basically just taking a lip liner because I wanted to do this entirely out of Kylie Lip Kit stuff. So I didn't want any micron pen in there. So I took lip liner and I took my ink drawing and I colored that in. Now from here, I'm just trying, I was having some trouble actually because there's not that many like, I own a lot of Kylie lip kits, but I don't have many that are a nice sort of neutral skin tone. So what ended up happening is she's a bit darker than she usually is, but you know, it's fine. Also, these lip kits aren't made for painting, I realize now. And it was fairly difficult to get them to act as paint. Plus, you had to use a lot of them. Um, so, I've actually been doing a lot of art lately. And I have an art Instagram. I'll write that out at the end. It's at poorly made art I think and you know I'm just been doing I've been sketching in my sketchbook every day I've been doing just a lot of stuff like that I'm participating in inktober this year so I'll be doing a lot of inking but ever since like the end of August I've been working really hard to get at least one sketch done a day and then on top of that some of these I'll do pieces like this one um for her hair, I didn't have like a solid black, so I was using this like reddish color from the uh, holiday collection, and then on top I'm go gonna like go over with my sparkly black. Uh, another problem I had is most of my skin tone ones were like the velvet lips instead of the matte lips, which made it just harder to use, but they kind of blended better. So you can see I keep having to dip that back in to try and get good color and it's kind of getting everywhere as I do this so later I will have to go and cut her out of it um this is kind of like a challenge I don't think I've seen this idea anywhere else so maybe we can start a challenge and I don't know it's interesting to try and use makeup as a medium for art because I really got into like drawing and painting and stuff through my interest in makeup because I really like to do makeup and try and like change faces with stuff and the same sort of contouring and blending stuff that came to me it through makeup is applied into my art which is part of the reason that I really like to do portraits even though this one just did not turn out that well especially that eye I like covered up the white part and, but you know it was a challenge and I'm probably never gonna do anything like this again so why not just embrace what I did you know um I posted this picture to Instagram of this portrait too I don't think it got that many likes it got um on let me check Instagram, let me go on to my art one. Yes, my art Instagram is poorly made art, no spaces, no caps. Um, it only got about, it got 29 likes, but yeah. And I did this before like the whole like scandal, like Kylie Jenner's pregnant and all that, which I, I don't even know guys, it's, that's just crazy. She's crazy, them Kardashians would be crazy, but, you know, if you can start a whole empire, I mean, so here I'm just cutting out, um, the finished portrait, which is kind of a wreck, as you can see, but, and there's a bit of sparkle in there, because, once again, the black lipstick I had was sparkly. I don't know. So here I'm just mounting it on some paper and yeah, it's done. <laughs>